This is Joyce and Brian with RV Travel for Less. We decided to revisit Silver Springs. Silver Springs was one of Florida's oldest commercial tourist attractions. Silver Springs had been offering glass bottom boat tours since around 1878. So we wanted to go back to Silver Springs and see if we liked Silver Springs, the state park, as much as we liked Silver Springs when it was one of Florida's theme parks. Now the glass you're looking through is one half inch plate glass, just like a window. No magnification and no special lighting. Now the uh, spring on its name, the Spring of Stars, because it's dedicated to all the movie stars that have been here over the years doing TV and movie productions as far back as 1916. Yeah, during the, during the winter, their uh, metabolism slows way down. They don't hibernate like a like a uh, a bear, but they they just kind of mill around. They do need the sun. They're very susceptible to the uh, to the cold. So you see them out here laying in the sun. From 1958 until 1961, the television series Sea Hunt was filmed at Silver Springs. Here's a shack from the old TV series. If you look below, you can see three statues. These statues are Zeus, Hades, and Poseidon. These statues can be seen in some of the older James Bond movies. After a boat ride, we walked around the park. We checked out the restaurant. There's some pictures from when we set up camp the night before. We had an electric and water hookup. There's another picture of the electric hookup. We had a grill and we had a fire ring. And then I went to check out the bathhouse and boy was I impressed. I loved how clean the bathhouse was. Would we go back to Silver Springs State Park? Well, we're not sure. We found that the state park was good for overnight camping and it was good for several hours of day activity. But unlike the theme park, it doesn't have all of the attractions, so it's not exactly a day trip. That's our opinion. What's yours? Please feel free to leave comments below. And thanks for watching.